Ruska up against Magnolia. There are two slick portions. Taha in the Butrata. Nice handoff, Sangalang, and an assist for the beast, Galvin Abueva. That's a good start for Ian Sangalang. He struggled in their very first game, so it's a good sign that he's getting off. They go inside Sangalang. Nice to take advantage of this matchup. Two free throws coming up here for Ian. That's a nice... Sangalang makes the first. He's got three points in the contest early. Um, but again, it's still early. You know, this is not set. We don't know if this is how easy. Fine Staha. Better footwork there shown by Trotter. Try to do too much out there. He's just going to put himself in the proper position to either make the right pass, to score, to read. Abueva sneaking in there will miss. Getting the rebound around three aces. And Misi thought about it, goes inside to Taha. Taha showing us some great footwork. That's a nice up and under move. And there's Sangalang trying to come up with some payback and does. Sangalang tries to shoot over the defense and does. So efficient and so effective inside the paint. One of the more traditional games of a big man. You don't see Sangalang, you know, extending out, knocking down three-point shots. He's in the block. Coming in favor of J.D. Casho. Oh, oh, yeah. That foul's going to be called on the beast. Towards the middle, use his body, his length, his size, over Calvin Weber, and drop steps towards the base. And that's good education for a lot of the young fans we've got watching. And so, you know, they can, they can try to bring that. Very proud to see both of his sons out here playing. That's what I'm talking about right there. That's where he had Cal Abueva in the, a few offensive sequences uh, prior to that one. You can master something like that. It's a nice defensive play there by Yusuf Taha with the block shot. If you can master something like this. Trying to take advantage of the size mismatch they have. Sangalang from the 15 foot line. Back inside the Taha. Falling away, yeah, hits that yeah, one. And there you go. You see, now, again, he's using his size. He has a soft touch around the basket. I thought he had a baseline. Don't get their act together fast. Paul's going to be called there, and Taha doesn't like it. Sangalang hits the deck. That's a nice flash by the big Ian Sangalang, flashing to the short corner. Just take one step, and you're under the basket. Exactly. More dynamic, uh, younger, fresh front line for Alaska. Well, Sangala and Misi has checked in together with Di Gregorio. Oh! Easy follow up there from Taha. You see, Sangala trying to back his way inside. Puts it up and it drops. Just so effective down low. A minute gone here in the fourth. Sangala barreling his way in. It's a basket and one opportunity here. Wow. Banal asking for a charge. We gotta see that again. Baptism by fire type, you know. He, As well. The young rookie going up against. Taha trying to carve out some space. Wow. Puts it up wow. and in. Another player fresh off the bench. Point that they don't panic. Taha gets it to drop. Nice find inside. Taha looking for a three point play. Gets it. It's amazing. And look, you know, this was off the pick and roll play. Right? All he did here was he set up Robbie Herndon. Robbie Herndon rewarded him. Lead by the Alaska Aces. Trying to go to Sangalang once again. That time he gets it to drop. Off We're tied once again. Off the picker. They got to make their move now. They look for Lee. Lee. Nice. Nice hand nice. off. Wow. And that's game. Unbelievable. They might have to review this to check it, but it looks like it, it is It looks counted. like it's good. It looks like it's good. You just got to take a look at the glass and see the red light go on. 